Hi everyone, um, opportunity this winter to spend some time with Sean and the rest of the Root Academy coaches on the high performance program out in Australia. Go and follow my footsteps. You sort of ask a lot of difficult questions of yourself and that's when you sort of find out um, if, if this is really what you want to do and if you're really willing to put in those hard yards and hard work to go on and play um, at the highest level. You pick a guy up at the airport that's sort of a young fella that you know, comes to Adelaide for the first time and you sort of run through your head and you just sort of wonder where he's going to go and you know, you've got the captain of England now and the, went to the academy of this training coach and it's just like, you know, it seems quite funny that that's sort of how it's all sort of worked out. I remember getting the opportunity to come out here at 19 years old. Um, I won an, um, a scholarship award through the MCC. They funded my flight over to come and play club cricket on a weekend for Prospect just up the road here and um, be part of the Darren Lehman Academy which worked Monday to Friday. You know it's hard out here when an English cricketer comes out here for the first time. What we talk about is making players uncomfortable um, and that's about them learning about themselves and I guess as coaches we get to see how they go about cricket. You know we're not necessarily going to give them um, hold their hand out here and tell them what to do. It's 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 very much about players being self-driven and sort of get away from home and actually learn cricket in another country and I guess learn more about themselves as as young cricketers that are trying to make it in the game. Obviously, we've had current England captain Joe Root. You know, there was a look in his eyes that I've never seen any other player, and why well, he was never going to be satisfied with playing for Yorkshire alone. He was always doing that extra work. He was always purposeful. He understood what he needed to do in that session. Um, and as a 20 year old that was that was very impressive so it's, it's no great surprise that he's done what he's had. Well a special time, a terrific time. England's captain, he's what dreams have made of. Yeah he's a superb player is Joe Root. What a wonderful way to start your year as captain. 100 in your first innings at the home of cricket. We do a lot of um, training where we put players in situations um, in terms of the game and, and Joe has been, was the best at that. I mean his ability to work out how to succeed in a, in a game type situation is, is better than anyone has been out here. Joe also was very very competitive. The conditioning part of the program like you know is quite tough and you know we had a guy called Scotty Borthwick who's also played a little bit for England. I mean Scott was a great athlete. Now Joe's not as good a natural athlete as um, Scott, but, but Joe used to always push himself right there with Scott um, and he just had that ability to really compete hard and he wanted to be, he wanted to be the best. The other, the other thing that Joe had is he had a great understanding of what it, what it took. Um, he's, he's got, you know, in a lot of ways it was like speaking to a 28 year old even though he was 20 at the time. Like he was very mature um, in terms of his person and understanding the game. You know, those things probably more so than his actual cricket ability, you know, he was very, very good at those those areas of his game, which I think's enabled him to sort of really progress in the game. That winter was, you know, it was instrumental in my progression as a, as a county player and then on to be an international. 